My research focuses on local politics, like the people that serve on your school board and like your city council. And these people have more of like an immediate impact on your life. And I think that they get too frequently ignored in the literature. My name is Tyler Simcoe. I'm a senior in the politics department and in the program for statistics and machine learning. This year, during my second term on the board, um, I was elected as president of the South Amboy Board of Education, which has been a very exciting new opportunity for me. I'm involved in the budget, the education, the staffing, the, you know, the policies. I'm the one that leads all the public meetings, and I try to go to all the events and the games. It's trying to be a face for the board and to, or to show them that, well, that we're not this like scary abstract body that makes all the decisions, but we're there to serve the students and the, and the public. It's an honor not only for myself as a new superintendent to have Tyler, who uh, was not too long ago a student here. Um, he's a product of our community, you know, not only as a student, but also as a valedictorian. Uh, so I think as a community, we're very proud of not only what he accomplished here as a student, but what he's accomplishing as a student in, at Princeton University and now serving in a leadership capacity on our school board. So at every door you go to, you'll start with the script, you'll read it through. But you'll only Tyler found very really interesting the like, uh, idea of using statistics and data analysis to study political problems and social science problems. When he ran for the yeah. uh, education board in his hometown, um, he ran the randomized experiment uh, trying to examine how different campaign messages affect the voters. I hope that the other students will take you know, from Tyler's story that there are so many things you can do if you take all the opportunities seriously and uh, work hard through senior thesis and junior papers, you can actually make a huge difference. I decided to teach for the Freshman Scholars Institute because I think it's very important for places like Princeton to, to ensure that students from all different types of backgrounds can succeed at Princeton. Oh, it's one story to have the experience to, to like be, be accepted to Princeton, but then tr trying to succeed once they get here is an entirely different story. Programs like FSI introduce students to a community of students that are going through the same types of things as them and um, can so support them both during the program and then afterwards. Well, the most important thing that you can do for other students is to be a mentor. Students that come from either first generation backgrounds or from schools like ours or that don't always send kids to Princeton. I don't think that those students should have to like figure out the whole process on their own. Well, if I can help them in some way with my own experiences, I will.